So there's times that a f as a farm, there's times that a f Open eye through the waves cut through me, hypnotized by the sounds I breathe. Today we're sharing, so I'm just getting ready. I got everything put up. I dropped a gate on my calf. It's bruised already, so that's gonna hurt. Anyway, a little bit of a klutz. Oh my god, it hurts. Charlie is on his way, he should be here any minute, and he shears. I get my shear in about two weeks before every group starts to lamb, and it just makes that area, the udder, really clean and um, and groomed, I guess, for those lambs to get right on. It's also getting warm. So regardless if they were lambing or not, it would have been a good time to get them sheared because uh, we're coming into some warmer warmer weather. You uh, should be sheared once a year regardless. It's just a lot of weight added to that skeletal frame of a U. Well, I know it's controversial. It shouldn't be. It's like, it's like us getting a haircut. So no matter what you see, uh, shearing needs to be done. I get people that know what they're doing. He can get a lot done. I think we have 80 to do today. So it'll take him most of the day, but uh, he makes quick and light work of it. Makes it look easy, it's not easy. I'm breathing in Hold tight, hold tight Can't make coals collide Hold tight, hold tight Hold tight Dripping lights Paint the skies All because of you Dripping lights Paint the skies Only you they have babies in the belly. <laughs> My black sheep. I think I have three. I had a Snapchat question from Evan. He wanted to know how big one of these wool bags are and how much they're worth. Charlie, tell me again. How big are the bags? How big the bags? Yeah. Man. Um, you know, like so average is about 150 pounds a bag and how much do they worth 50 cents right now 50 cents a pound. and right now the price is 50 cents a pound That part that Charlie was doing down by the udder, that's that's the stuff I really want off. Some people actually shear the back end and the udders, and it's called, I think it's called crutching. I might have screwed that up, but I think that's what it's called. Charlie, what's it called when they only shear the udder and the back, like the tail end? Crutching. I got it right. I have a conference call, so Shania just got here, so she's gonna finish up Charlie. And uh, yeah, he's ripping right along. He should be done within the hour, so 
he's doing quite well. They're shearing really nice. They look amazing. The ewes aren't even running away. They keep coming back to for more love. <laughs> We got shearing done. Shearing is done. And now I have an appointment. I have a conference call is done. So showering did not happen. I've got the cooler in the back because I'm going to pick up beer on the way home. We've plugged in a lot of corn in the last three or four days. The boys are tired. Um, I haven't had to do much because I'm not really trusted on the planter or the strip till, I guess. So I've been like on, in the buddy seat, bringing out food, which put me on a cultivator any day. I freaking hate taking out meals because I suck at it. And I took the wrong, I shouldn't have took this turn. I should not drive and talk because I get confused. Off to the orthodontist. So I have adult braces because you wasn't humiliating enough as a teenager, I have to have them again. Hence the drool all the time. I'm sure you didn't notice. I notice. So I turned 40 and I'm sore all the time and my teeth have all moved. There's times as a farm wife that you can take a video of your husband sitting beside you on a tractor, and there's times where you don't. Tonight was the time that you don't. So what I did as a good farm wife was deliver beer. Because it was one of those days for him. We're actually renting this farm off a good friend, and her mom actually just brought, us, brought Mark out a sub. I love neighbors. I love friends. This is what farming is all about. Everybody comes together. So that was pretty awesome. So thank you, Janet, for the sub. Good night, everyone. Can make me